Welcome to Around the World Channel. Pompeo calls Bolton a traitor as Trump administration scrambles to halt book release, CNN. CNN Secretary of State Mike Pompeo on Thursday accused former National Security Advisor John Bolton of being a traitor in a forceful rebuke of Bolton's new book. Six NFL teams could be landing spot for Jets' Jamal Adams, New York Post. Jamal Adams is trying to force a trade from the Jets and pick his destination, bold move with two years remaining on his contract. What is Juneteenth? CBS News. On June 19, 1865, enslaved African Americans in Galveston, Texas, received news that they were free. Now, people across the nation observe the holiday 155 years later. Jimmy Kimmel to take summer off from talk show, guest hosts who aren't Matt Damon will fill in, EU.com. Jimmy Kimmel Live will be going Jimmy Kimmel less soon, the late night host announced in a video that Thursday's show would be his last of the summer. SEC to Mississippi, change Confederate-themed flag or risk losing college sports events, NBC News. The NCAA's Southeastern Conference on Thursday told the state of Mississippi it could miss out on SEC championship games if it doesn't change its state flag, which includes a Confederate symbol. California Gov. Newsom makes face masks mandatory amid rising coronavirus cases, NPR. Gov. Gavin Newsom said requiring masks is a necessary step as Californians continue to ignore recommended face covering guidelines, Jeff Chu AP updated at 8.39 p.m. Ring of Fire Solar eclipse set to blot out most of the sun this weekend, CNET. Photographer Kristen M. Caldon captured this annular solar eclipse sequence at the Grand Canyon National Park in 2012, Kristen M. Supreme Court blocks Trump's bid to end DACA, a win for undocumented dreamers, The Washington Post. Read the Supreme Court's DACA decision Roberts was in the majority in both cases, and Thursday's ruling showed once again the pivotal role he now plays at the center of the court, his low-key ruling. Britain scraps its doomed contact tracing app, turns to Apple and Google for help, Gizmodo. Britain swore an oath of sovereignty against Apple and Google earlier this year, resolving to devise a workable contact tracing app that didn't have to cave to Apple and Google's user privacy demands. Canadian politician kicked out of Parliament for calling rival racist NPR. Jagmeet Singh, who heads the left-leaning New Democratic Party, was booted from the House of Commons for the day after calling Bloc Québécois politician Alain Therrien a racist on Wednesday. Please, like this video and subscribe to the channel if you want to stay tuned for upcoming news.